Welcome to How to Draw. I will be showing you how I draw my style. This episode, I will be drawing my snowboard character, Winter. Materials needed. A laptop or a computer. Easy Paint Tool Sci. That is a drawing program I will be using. A tablet. I use a Wacom Bamboo Create. And a tablet pen. Pencil and paper works fine too if you do not have a tablet. First of all, create a new file. Make it any size you want. I always start off with a thousand by a thousand. You're then going to need to save it. Once saved and named, you will see the file name, where the arrow is pointing at. Start off with a basic sketch. I am using the pen tool at size 4, and opacity at 43%. It is easier to see this way. This is a bust shot, also known as a head and chest drawing. I'm starting with the head first. Where these lines meet, draw a line to start the muzzle. Make a short, box-like shape as you see here. Make a triangle shape for the nose, as shown. For the top of the muzzle, make a triangle shape, like this. Then, make the upper jaw mouth part, like this. Don't worry if it's not perfect, you can fix it later. Make the bottom jaw, make sure it connects to the head, as shown. Now it's time to work on the eyes. They can be any shape you want, mine look like an oval teardrop shape. I drew a line across the eye and above the muzzle so I know where the other eye goes, as you see here. Draw the other eye in. I then draw these circles above the eyes. They are like eyebrows, but on animals. Then I make the cheeks, as shown here. Then make the sides of the face and the top of the head, connect it to the cheeks. Now make the ears. They look like curvy boxes. Make the ear insides and the ear details. Here I have cleaned up the sketch, added some details, and added some cheap fluff. Now add some fur on the body and add an arm. Add some detail and fix up the sketch. Now it is time to ink it, also known as the outline. I use the ink tool at size 4. If you are drawing on paper, use a pen. All inked, make sure you ink on a new layer. The sketch here is gone, and if you are drawing on paper, erase the sketch. Use the magic wand tool outside of the lines, as shown here. The blue is what is selected. Click selection, then invert. The inside of the drawing is now selected. On a new layer, under the line art, start coloring. Use the pen tool. All colored, make sure you deselect everything. I then pick out two textures. I copy and paste them onto my drawing. Pick one texture for the background, drag it under the lines and color layers. The other stays above the color layer. Scale each texture to cover the background and the body. Select the drawing on the color layer. Hit selection, then invert. Go on to that texture's layer and erase everything outside of the drawing. Then clear the selection. Under mode, click multiply. Then change the opacity to 38% or to whatever looks best to you. Create a new layer under the background texture layer and pick a color. I use a dark teal. Make sure that the texture layer is on multiply. It changes the texture color. Use the selection box tool to create widescreen bars on the image, as shown. Use the bucket tool to color them in black. Merge the lines, texture, and color layer together and select the drawing. Go to selection, click increment three times. It makes it look like your selection has gotten bigger. Create a new layer under the layer you are currently using. Pick out a color and use the bucket tool to color in that layer. It gives it a nice outline. Sign it and add your watermark. And there, it's done! Save the image as a JPEG. A page like this shows up. Make sure everything looks good, then click OK. Here is the finished drawing. I hope this helped. Here are some other examples of my work.